Welcome to the presentation and demo about the Bordel Gateway Interop with Oracle Entitlement Server. We'll start with a number of slides that introduce the architecture, showing how the Bordel Gateway operates in conjunction with Oracle Entitlement Server. Bordel Gateway acts as a policy enforcement point, acting on traffic and delegating authorization to Oracle Entitlement Server, which is the policy decision point. The gateway also performs threat scanning and throttling of the incoming traffic. In this example, we'll see a REST request coming from a browser. The Bordel Gateway is delegating authorization to Oracle Entitlement Server, then only authorized requests are allowed forward to an API. The API that we're using is a stock option put request, and what we'll do is we'll show now a policy which has been configured in Oracle Entitlement Server, such that only a trader called Joe Trader can access this particular API. It's a REST request which is accessed with a GET verb. So we see that Joe Trader is granted to the access to use a GET request against the stock put option resource. Here we see the configuration in Oracle Entitlement Server, which is going to be enforced by the Bordel Gateway. Now we see a policy that's been set up on the gateway where we're not yet doing authorization. What we're doing is authentication of a user. We're constructing the API call then that goes to the stock put option API. What we're going to do is add in the authorization filter that connects to Oracle Entitlement Server. We simply drag and drop it into our palette and now we configure with the information that we need to link it to the policy that we've already set up in Oracle Entitlement Server. The resource that we're requesting access to is the stock put option. So we put that information in there the action then is the verb which is coming from the browser. In this case, we dynamically pull that in using a wildcard here, the HTTP request verb. Once we put this information here, the Bordel Gateway has the information it needs in order to produce the request to Oracle Entitlement Server, which requests authorization for the authenticated user, in this case Joe Trader, to the resource, which is the stock put option. We simply drag the arrows to bring this into our policy so it occurs after authentication and then before the request goes out to the API. Now we see the completed circuit within the Vordel Policy Studio which is leveraging the connection to Oracle Entitlement Server. We simply dragged and dropped in the filter and configured it. The API which we're using is a API from Zignite which is a commercial provider of APIs on the web these web services um, include financial services. In this case, it's to get the price on a put option on a particular stock. We're going to call it through a browser. The browser connection is going to the gateway, which is going to apply the policy to the request that's coming to it. Here we see the different parameters we're putting in, the day, the month, and the year for our stock put option. We authenticate as Joe Trader in the browser with HTTP authentication and then the gateway authorizes and connects us to the service and then it converts the response to JSON which comes back to the browser. Here we see the JSON response coming back indicated that we have been authorized to access this particular service. So we see the response come back which is the put option price. We can see what the gateway has done by looking at the real-time monitoring. Again in the browser we see that the most recent request has gone through successfully authenticated and then successfully authorized against Oracle Entitlement Server. We see everything else the gateway has done, including instructing the API call and converting the response to JSON. We see when we hover over that filter that the Oracle Entitlement Server authorization has passed. So in summary, the request went to the Vordal Gateway. The Vordal Gateway was configured using Policy Studio to have a filter which called out to our entitlement server for authorization. 